Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here and welcome to another video. Today we're going to be talking about uh, the new gameplay patch. Dude, I ate cookies yesterday. Look at that face. Ugh. I'm not eating cookies anymore, man. That thing was destroyed me. But listen, guys, we're going to talk about this gameplay patch, yeah? Um, I am going to say something and I really feel like people need to hear this, okay? I'm not a fan of people making stuff up at the spot on the spot when it comes to new gameplay patches rolling out like all of a sudden your players feel slower all of a sudden your players feel faster all of a sudden uh there's more blocks all of a sudden finesse shots are more effective the only time that ever happened in terms of a patch being in the game which we didn't notice which which wasn't written but was in the game was a huge buff on defensive ai last year right i don't think it was in the patch notes at all but it was definitely a thing right Guys, when you judge the gameplay, there's too many people saying that they're going to wait until foot champs to really judge it. I don't trust those people at all when they say stuff like that. Let me explain why, okay? Division rivals, foot drafts, and foot champs is all on, is all on a server in California. They, have, they probably have multiple servers in California, obviously, but that's where it's located. I have the NetDuma router, so when I connect to the server, when I connect to foot draft games... Division Rival games and Foot Champs games, it always connects to the same exact server. So it's always in California, okay? I need people to understand this, right? When you judge the gameplay patch, waiting for people to say, I'm going to wait until the Foot Champs comes out to judge it is, is completely wrong. Do not trust these people, okay? This is what you have to trust. When you play the game... Within the first five seconds, I, I've, I've explained this so many times, okay? I'm not trying to be toxic. I'm just, trying to, I'm just trying to explain this to you guys. Within the first five seconds, you can tell if your game is good, bad, if there's delay, so on and so forth, okay? I'll tell you my experience when it comes to the patch. Yesterday, we streamed. We played four foot draft games and we played three foot champs games. My four foot draft games were slow, but the commands weren't shitty. The gameplay was slow, but the commands weren't shitty. Right? Slow gameplay, but decent commands very rarely happen before the patch. So I need to put that in there right now, okay? During the daytime and everything, okay? All my draft games were like that. I still didn't like it because it was too slow. You know what I'm saying? Like, players were heavy, blah, blah, but... When I was using the controller against the gameplay, you know how you guys saw the delay video where I'm going to the right and blah, blah, didn't do it. But hear me out on this, okay? Here's the thing with the patch, guys. There is still inconsistent gameplay. They did not fix the inconsistent gameplay. That's not what it was supposed to be fixed. I, I had so many people messaging me, right, when they released the patch saying Inception. Aren't you happy that they released this patch uh, to fix a gameplay? No, because I know after five years of five installments of FIFA of experiencing this, it's not the delay that does it. It's some sort of messed up coding in the game that does different gameplays. That still exists in FIFA, okay? That still exists, but we're taking baby steps because I, I very rarely ever had slow gameplay with decent commands because you guys have seen my delay video it's slow gameplay with terrible commands right and that is what drives you insane is when you have that type of gameplay okay now i played division rivals i think i played uh the first the first match and the second match i think we're okay i think i enjoyed the gameplay for the most part and which is very very rare very, very rare. Very rare, right? Camp against God squads and everything. Like these, yo, when you guys hit 2300 and above, or even 2200 and above, oh my god, the amount of people that have full icon squads is, oh. When I was facing these teams, I was still enjoying the game because the general gameplay experience was good. The fact that I was actually able to time my dribbling, like, because if you guys have ever watched my controller while I'm streaming, like when I'm using the left stick and I'm going boom, boom, it doesn't do boom, boom. Sometimes they just keep looking straight and they never do down, 
when I was using Mares and Salah, they were actually doing it in those one or two games. I think it was two games when I first played my division rival games. Then, then, again, inconsistent gameplay, still a thing. And I've been talking to the guys at EA about this, right? And they're working hard to, to fi finally fix the issue, okay? Because, whoo, got to calm down because it's been five installments. But, hey, it's looking, this is baby steps. The delay part, cool. For me, at least. I'm not going to say that's, that's the case for everybody, but that's how it was for me. But then the last three Foot Champs games that I played last night... Here's how I can explain the gameplay, and this is how I explain it to my chat. Even though I, even the first game that I noticed that I won 3-2, right? The game felt like jello. The game speed was good, but the controls were so unnatural. But it wasn't unnatural because of delay, it was unnatural because of the gameplay. Does that make sense? Like, this is what people need to understand. This is why, guys, believe me when I make these videos, please trust me when I make these videos because I am so tired of reading comments of people saying certain mechanics change when it's just inconsistent gameplay, okay? That patch was not going to fix inconsistent gameplay. But the delay? I'm gonna say this right now. I feel like the delay personally helped me. I'm not saying delay was completely removed because here's the thing. When your gameplay is different, like the gameplay that I had in my last three division rival games, when it feels like jello, the controls are unnatural. So for people sometimes, when you have unnatural controls, that's where people are like, this is delay, right? But that's not from delay, that's from unnatural controls. Stuff like uh, when I do a fake shot perfectly, I sent this to Zara already, I sent this to Corey, the fake shot stop, and they pass the ball. But that happens more often in that type of gameplay. Basically, when you just roll, you roll your hands, circle to X, they do this little animation delay where they kind of like stop and then they just kick the ball forward. You can tell it's going to happen if you've played this game enough and you know that your game feels like Jello, that they're going to do that, right? That's why I need you guys to trust me when it comes to the gameplay stuff. Delay, I'm not going to say a six for everybody because I feel like certain people in certain countries it's still going to be really messed up for you. And I know that for a fact. I think if you guys are from like Colombia or something, I still think you guys match up to North American servers, which is pretty far from you guys, to be fair. So it's, it's probably not going to be great for you. And I 100% and I understand that. But for a North American guy connected to the California servers on consistent 25, 30 ping, that's how it was before and that's how it is now. It's been working out so far delay-wise, Okay. But guys, please understand that when you are talking about different gameplay mechanics, you are just experiencing inconsistent gameplay, okay? Again, when my game felt like uh, Jello, players are skating all over the place. The controls, it's like, it's hard to explain. Like, you'll be aiming the thumbstick up, maybe diagonally to the right, and then you'll feel your players slide to that direction. And then when you want to turn to a different direction, he doesn't transition well because he's still sliding. But that's not that gameplay that I experienced for those last three games. That wasn't delayed. That was the gameplay being like that. There's a huge difference between the two, right? Between delay and the gameplay making it feel like it's delay. Do you guys get what I'm saying? There's a huge difference, right? Um, when I did skill moves... It was very unnatural. Like I said, I think my favorite games that I played yesterday was my first, and I don't remember if it was one or two games, but it was my first and my second Division Rival games were games that I actually enjoyed. And if you guys want to go watch the stream in the past broadcast, you guys can go do that. But if you guys watch the gameplay and you look very closely to the player movement, look at how my players move in the first Foot Rivals game and then look at how they move in like, uh, the third last, second last, and then last game in that in that stream. You can see the difference if you're spotting it. Just the difference of sliding that your players are doing. Okay? You can see it. Guys, this is just inconsistent gameplay that causes these things. Okay? So if you're experiencing different gameplay, that's not... And I need to... I know I've reiterated this like six times already in this video. But that's not what they fixed, guys. Okay? If you notice that your players are doing more deflections, 
uh, and stuff like that. Deflections is a huge thing in this FIFA. Like yesterday, the amount of deflections I conceded those last three games, I conceded honestly. I think it was five or six goals of deflections. And even even like my my um, uh, people from my chat who faced me would come to the game and they're like, Inception, I'm sorry that my goals were garbage. I know that they got deflection. And I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be like, no, bro, you suck. No, because. You're going to take what you can get. If you get deflections go your way and you shoot, you take it. Hey, no problem. But I'm never angry at the opponent when they score. I'm just angry at the game. You know what I'm saying? I'm angry at the game. Like, why? Why do I defend properly and can see these deflections, right? Like yesterday. I even, I even, I'm using the manual goalkeeping stuff now. And even the second goal, I manually, I was manually using the goalkeeper perfectly. I predicted his finesse shot. Both my defensive AIs deflect the ball right back to him. He just has to shoot into an empty net. That type of stuff is frustrating, of course. But that is inconsistent gameplay, guys. Okay, that's just different gameplay. You can feel, like I said, within the first 5 or 10 seconds of playing the game, you can feel the difference of how your players feel. I need you guys to, to really, really put your faith and trust in me when I make these videos, okay? Because... I'm not biased towards results. I've been complaining about this for five installments. All I want is good gameplay where if I lose, I'm just like, when I'm straight, I'm just like, next game. That's what I want, okay? But if I know I'm playing in shit gameplay, I can't, I can't have that mentality, right? But the delay thing, I feel like it helped me personally. It helped me personally because I never had, ne I'm not going to say I never had. I very rarely had slow gameplay with good commands. When I had slow gameplay, it was always, always terrible commands. And then those, those, foot, those foot rivals games, those, again, those first, the first one and the second one, I liked those games. They weren't the best, though. They weren't there just yet, but they were really, really good enough for me to enjoy the game, right? I hate the game mechanics of finesse shots, moving the goalkeeper, and 1v1 finishing being shit, and defensive AI needing a small nerf, but... I like that when I was playing that game, I felt like I had control of my players. I feel like that was a very important thing for me. But then those last three games, that's when they felt like jello. Like, you would switch, the switching. The first thing I noticed, the switching, when I played in the slow gameplay, my switching was good. When I was playing the slow gameplay for foot drafts, I was switching with the right stick and I'm like, wow, it's going to the players. Even in the first or second, uh, first and second, maybe, uh, division rival games, same thing. Switching was fantastic. L1 switching, right stick switching. I don't know why I'm using my controller. I'm just, you know, I'm being weird. It was beautiful. And in the last three games, it was gone. I couldn't transition properly. I couldn't switch to the player and then accelerate in the opposite direction because they were still sliding in that other direction. More deflections happened. Uh, more sliding of dribbling, like more emphasis on the first touches. But... Decent game speed, you know, what I'm saying like it's so it's such a weird thing inconsistent gameplay is a weird thing guys But listen listen when I tell you guys this man Inconsistent gameplay has not been changed. It has not been fixed delay may have but inconsistent gameplay hasn't so if you are experiencing different gameplay You will soon experience different gameplay after That's how the game works. They haven't fixed that yet. So please guys Take that into mind when you are judging the gameplay. You don't have to wait until foot champs to judge it because that doesn't make sense. It literally takes five hours of your day. I would say for me personally, if I, if I spend it from two o'clock to like seven and then maybe even keep going from that, that's the way to truly judge it. To see if even with the delay fix, if the delay helps with when you get inconsistent gameplay. Because... Again, I didn't feel delay in the, in the Jello gameplay, but I felt delay because the gameplay was delayed. Really, really big difference, okay? Because my gameplay was not delayed in the slow gameplay, but it was in the Jello gameplay, and you can feel it, okay? Very, very important to know, guys. Very, very important. Uh, that's pretty much going to do it for me today in terms of the video. I just wanted to give my thoughts on the gameplay patch because I feel like a lot of people just... just Say random stuff, and I and I, I just don't like it. I want this game to improve, so let's let's be sure when a good patch rolls out, if the inconsistent gameplay has been fixed or if delay has been fixed. I can't say for delay for everybody because I live in Canada. I get connected to North American servers. I can't say for everybody else. I'm sure it's still pro a problem for you guys, right? For some of you guys in Colombia, um, maybe if you're even from like Bolivia or something. 
maybe i don't know i i can't judge that i'm from canada so that's the only way i can judge it but uh that is gonna conclude the video for today guys i hope you guys did enjoy it i will see you guys in the next video um not sure if i'll do a foot miss video today we'll see i might do a foot miss rant to be honest because foot miss has been awful um this year flashback SBCs were the best like they were literally amazing and then the foot miss has been very very underwhelming so uh we'll go ahead and get to that later maybe not really sure but i'm gonna keep this as one of the uploads for today right so uh, i'll catch you guys for the next video peace out dudes love you guys